Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to do a summer camp worthy makeup look. Now I know for a lot of people, they just don't want to wear makeup to summer camps. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Um, this is my makeup bag that I will be taking. It says princess on it and it has like little hearts and such. I think it's really cute. Um, but what we're going to do is, first of all, I'm going to take a headband. You can use, like, headbandy headbands or just the little stretchy ones like this. But I'm going to use this one. Anyways, so we're going to start out with a concealer. Um, this is the NYC Cover Stick. It is in the lightest co color called light new one what we're gonna do is you're just going to go underneath your eyes with it and you're going to cover up any like red spots And stuff like that and then you're just going to take your finger and you're going to blend it in so you don't look like an albino raccoon I know like underneath my eyes looks like super pale right now, but after we put on other makeup that will get fixed. Okay, so the next step is I'm going to take my e.l.f. Tinted Moisturizer in the color Porcelain. And what's great about this is it has SPF 20 in it, and especially if you're fair skinned like me, you get sunburned ridiculously bad so this kind of just helps but what you do is you just like take your finger you squirt it out to a little glob then you just do your little finger magic and then it kind of looks yellow but then you just when you're in and even this color is dark for my skin tone, but after you blend it in, it kind of looks better. And this doesn't give you too much coverage, but it gives you enough coverage to where you don't look gross. And you can tell that, like, I'm a little shiny and stuff. And if you want to, you can just take, like, like a powder... Any powder is fine, really, and you can just, like, go over spots where you get super oily during the day. The next step is we're going to take an eyeshadow primer, and I don't have an eyeshadow primer personally, but I'm just going to use the, like, CoverGirl Concealer. And I used to use this for my regular concealer, but it gave me lots of problems because it was too, like, watery and it wouldn't ever, like, stick good. Like, as you could tell with the NYC cover stick, it, it was very, it had a lot of coverage and that was really great for my skin. Like this, I would put it over, like, problem areas and it just wouldn't do anything. But I found that it works for a great eyeshadow base, so that's always a plus. But it just comes with a little applicator and you're going to just like dab it on your lids and it's going to look a little silly at first but then you just got to blend it out. And what this is going to do is it's going to help your eyeshadow stay all day long 
which will be great because especially if it's like super hot outside you definitely want your eyeshadow to stay for a super long time now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the elf eyeshadow brush and I'm going to take a light brown color in this case I'm going to use the Rimmel London palette I got this a super long time ago so I don't even know if you can find it anymore but I love it and you're just going to apply this all over your eye area and I say all over because it works for a great highlight too okay now we're going to use the medium color in this palette and we're going to take the e.l.f. crease blush and I love this brush so much like it's so great um and we're just going to swirl it around in there and we're going to apply it to our crease And this will just give our eyes more definition. And if you want to, which this is always a step that I like to add. Um, sorry, my makeup just fell. Um, I'll take this one and I'll put it right here in the very outer corner. Now what I'm going to do next, and this is optional, and I'm not going to do it today actually, but you can just take an eyeliner. I probably wouldn't use a, uh, a liquid liner just because I have, like, it's harder to do that. And like, where we're going, we're going to a bunch of cabins and they don't even have mirrors, so that would just be a huge no-no for me. And I love my winged liner, but I can go without it for a few days. Um, but I would use this, which is just the Maybelline Unstoppable Lip. What in the world? Not lip pencil. It's like an eyeliner twisty thing. It's in the color Cinnabar. And it's just a light brown color. And I love it. It's very easy it just glides right on it's super nice um but since I'm skipping that step I'm going to go straight to uh the mascara and I will be using covergirl lash blast Lux. um to finish it off, I'm going to take my e.l.f. blush, you just apply it to your cheek area, and just take your fingers and rub it in, and it gives you a nice natural glowy look and this too since it's like a cream blush it will last a whole lot longer um and just to finish it off I'm going to take my Burt's Bees beeswax lip balm well anyways this is the finished makeup look I hope you enjoyed it's just very natural probably super easy the easiest one I'll probably ever do um but thanks for watching bye